Well, we'll take a look at that heat index in just a second, and we will show you exactly what that breeze has or has not been doing. Take a look at that radar first. Again, you are seeing, well, not a whole lot of anything out there. No rain to help you cool down. We had a few showers pop up near Rome and Buchanan, just a little bit down near Griffin earlier. Nothing in terms of any lightning. The lightning has been staying far to the west. That's been staying near Alabama. Here in Georgia, yeah, you're just not seeing any of that. Watch those temperatures. 94 right now. You're seeing that in Athens. 90 in Atlanta, 90 in Noonan. And what was I talking about? The breeze, is it helping? No. You're seeing, feeling 96. So that breeze out there is really just kind of stirring the hot air around. You're feeling 100 degrees. You've hit the triple digits in terms of what it feels like for you folks in Noonan. I feel sorry for you. 92 in, in LJ, 99 in Rome. It is going to stay warm out there tonight. You're not going to have much of a chance of a cool down. A live look out there showing us that, yeah, we've got blue sky. Guys, part of the problem, letting all that sunshine get through, heating us up dramatically. There it is, just a few scattered clouds out there. We call that sheep back clouds, and it looks like just fluffy clouds off the back of a sheep. Some of those, some of those causing just a little bit of a flare-up of some rain in there, and that's about it. You're not getting any kind of heavy rain that's going to cool you off dramatically. So again, yeah, it's going to stay warm tonight and dry, but tomorrow there is hope in sight. Take a look at this. As the front rolls through, it's going to move in, as you know, from the northwest, push on down to the south. This is very typical for this time of the year, and it's going to possibly bring us some good solid rains as we head into the noon hour. So as you start off for work tomorrow morning, fairly dry. You might see a few sprinkles, a little bit of rain here and there by around 2, 3 o'clock. There it is. Starting to push on through 4 o'clock. Heavier rains possible, especially as we do head into that Canton area, Rome, Gainesville, Atlanta. You could see some of that stronger stuff. Stuff moving on through Eatonton, Carrollton on through 8 o'clock. So all day tomorrow, pretty good chance for rain. What's that going to do to our temperatures? There is good news in sight. We do have about a 30 on average to 40% chance for rain. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday getting even better because also those temperatures are going to be lowering as a result of those showers. So watch that. 92 tomorrow lowering to the lower or to the upper 80s then to the mid 80s as we head into Thursday and take a peek at this. You're even going to hit 85 by the time you get to Friday. So yep, it's going to get better. Hang on. We've got about 24 more hours of these 90 degree temperatures and then we're back into the bearable mid-80s. Steve and Joy Ross from Griffin sent us this beautiful sunset photo. Send yours to pics at cbsatlanta.com.